Hello everyone, welcome to PHTV4. I'm Sue Jankowski here with the City News for Palos Heights. The farmer's market in Palos Heights is up and running. It's located at the municipal parking lot, which is at 12217 South Harlem Avenue, right between the new shop High Five and Royal Jewelers. It is on Wednesdays from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. rain or shine. There'll be no market on July 3rd. Besides the expected fruits and vegetables, the farmer's market is bursting with many additional vendors. For example, you can find bakery items, pretzels, candles, and jewelry, flowers, plants, and more. There are international foods and cheeses. If you've been looking for Tupperware or herbs and spices, I think you may find it at the farmer's market. There are dozens of booths. Booths, part of the fun, uh, the farmer's market is shopping side by side with your neighbors and friends. Support our local vendors by stopping by the farmer's market. It will continue through October 9th. Pale's Pool is open. There are swim lessons available. There are two water slides, a diving board, and a wading pool for children under five years old. Early bird lap swimming is available six days a week, and there is a full service concession stand. The pool is open until August 18th and is closing a bit early this season for pool locker room remodels and the addition of a new slide. You can purchase a season pass or pay a daily rate. You've been probably at the pool uh, driven by many times. It's located next to City Hall and Memorial Park. The address is 6601 West 127th Street. You can find more information at www.palisheightsrec. Org. Pass Health Food is now a permanent drop-off location for the food pantry at Palis United Methodist Church. You can drop off the non-perishable food donations at Pass Health Foods, which is located at 7228 West College Drive in Palis Heights. Donations are accepted every day when the Pass Health Food store is open. Palos Heights seniors, citizens, meet on the second and fourth Wednesday at 1 p.m. at the Palos Heights Recreation Center at 6601 West 127th Street. The fourth Wednesday meetings are for day trips. Meetings include entertainment and lunch. If you need more information, please call Edna Craig at 708-378-9782. The Pace Municipal Vehicle Program is available for those who need transportation. You may schedule a ride to and from any location in Palos Heights. The cost is $2 for a one-way trip and $4 for a round trip. The ride program is available Monday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. and on Saturdays from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. Rides can be booked only one week in advance. Call 708-361-1807 to schedule a ride. Let me say that again. 708-361-1807 to schedule a ride. Pathlights, formerly known as Plow's Council on Aging, helps navigate and celebrate aging in the southwest suburbs of Cook County. Pathlights has been guiding individuals, caregivers, families, and friends along the best path to aging, providing resources, advocacy programs, and services needed to live with independence and dignity in the community. Call Pathlights at 708-361-0219 or go to their website at www.pathlights.org. <coughs> There's some fun coming up if you choose to go to the Summer Movie Nights provided by CNB Bank and Trust. July 26, watch Candy Cane Lane at Memorial Park. August 16th, you can view Monsters University at Myers Park, and September 6th, Barbie will be playing. Bring your chairs, blankets, picnics, or snacks, and enjoy watching a movie under the stars. Memorial Park is across from the Palos Heights Pool, and Myers Park is behind the Palos Heights Recreation Center. Concerts in the Park has a couple more concerts coming up. Bring your chairs, blankets, and snacks, or dinner, and prepare to want to sing and dance because Miss Angie, Angie and the Misters will be playing on July 25th, and the Chicago Experience will be rocking on August 15th. The concerts are from 7 p.m. to 8.30 p.m. and are held at Memorial Park, which is at 7607 West College Drive. 
These concerts are very popular, so you may want to arrive early and enjoy a lovely evening with neighbors, friends, and family. The concerts are sponsored by CNB, Bank and Trust, and the Palos Heights Public Library, and of course with the participation of the Palos Heights Park and Recreation Department. Lake Catherine is a great place to spend some time no matter what the season is. Right now, there are boat rentals available Monday through Sunday from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Canoes and kayaks cost $10 per person per hour to rent. Participants must be six years of age or older, and children under 18 must be accompanied by an adult. The Lake Catherine area has great hiking paths and an exciting nature center. Classes and programs are available. Take time to stroll around the gardens and enjoy the grasses and flowers and shrubs. The waterfall is a great place just to have a wonderful calming moment and enjoy being in nature. If you would like to be a volunteer or need service hours, contact the Lake Catherine staff for information on what's available and how to get started. Lake Catherine is located at 7402 West Lake Catherine Drive. The phone number is 708-361-1873. The deadline for Keep Palis Heights Beautiful Award is August 1st, 2024 for the gardens and landscaping. The deadline for the other categories is September 24th. If you have seen a house, subdivision, entrance, school, church, business, or garden that really looks terrific, you can nominate that place for recognition. If you want more information on this, call Eileen at 708-466-7089 or email millerjoanne805 at uh, gmail.com. The Little Red Schoolhouse Nature Center at 9800 Willow Springs Road in Willow Springs is our nearby Forest Preserve Center. They have many opportunities for you, no matter what age you are, to explore the local natural area. Seniors can enjoy nature inside or outside, rain or shine. You can join in for a nature-inspired adventure Thursday, July 11th, and August 8th at 10 a.m. If you enjoy finding out about nature, there are many programs through July 5th to August 30th on Fridays. Maybe you are someone who wants some action. You can join in the removal of invasive plants. Tools, gloves, and a snack are provided. Closed toe shoes and long pants are encouraged, and you must be 18 years of age and up. This happens July 13th and August 10th from 10 a.m. to noon. Or enjoy all levels of yoga class indoors with a certified instructor, and then stay for a self-guided walk after the program. Write down July 28th and August 25th from 10 to 11 a.m. if you're interested in doing yoga at the Little Red Schoolhouse. All ages are welcome to enjoy live performances while overlooking the slough at sunset. It's Nature Open Mic Night, Thursdays, July 11th, 6.30 to 8.30 p.m. and Thursday, August 15th, 6 to 8 p.m. Call 708-839-6897 to register or stop by in person. There are many fun and interesting activities taking place at the Little Red Schoolhouse. I just named a few of them. The Classic Car Show will take place on Thursday, July 18th. This is the largest gathering of classic cars in the area. View hundreds of classic cars from the 1920s through the 1980s, all on display on both sides of Harlem Avenue, between 122nd Street through 125th Street. Enjoy food from local merchants, beverages for the kids, and ice cold beer from local bars and restaurants. Live music and a disc jockey will be playing all the classic hits through the evening. And last, but not least, is the Palos Heights Independence Day celebrations. On Wednesday, July 3rd at Memorial Park and Community Park, you will find all kinds of fun for everyone. At the Community Park, there will be inflatables and games from 10 a.m. until 1 p.m. At Memorial Park, Gates open at 5 p.m. You will find a DJ from 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. and a live band in the gazebo from 7 p.m. to 9.15 p.m. Fireworks begin at about 9.15 p.m. Also, on Thursday, July 4th, Palos Heights will celebrate with an annual Independence Day Parade 
right down Harlem Avenue. The parade begins at 12 p.m. This is two fun experiences for the entire family. Our Channel 4 will be there, as we have been for the last 20 plus years, to record the parade so that you can enjoy it again, or for those who cannot attend, enjoy it at home. I'm really excited about all the opportunities that we have in the city of Palos Heights to enjoy our city and celebrate our country. I hope that we see you there. Thanks for watching us here at PHTV. I'm Sue Jankowski. Make it a great day.